Hey there, everyone, this is Sal Cow playing The Lost Viking, the tale of two mighty Viking warriors, the powerful Maliog and the unflinchable Olaf, as well as our buddy Red who hops around. Prehistory is where we're at, because it's the dinosaur world. There's snails. Alright, so, I mean... I feel like very early on we got kind of a thing going. That is an extra unpermanent health bar. I don't really need it as far as I'm aware. I mean, maybe I will. It's just like, it doesn't seem like the risk is worth it all that much. Anything there? I can throw an arrow there if I want. Do I want? I don't know. So here, hmm. Whoops, I messed that up. All right, well, you know what? Maybe you can act as a distraction, and then you can pop up and destroy in the back. Oh, your mighty shell is... There you go. Not so mighty anymore. Can you push this rock? Can you throw an arrow at this? Ah, okay. See, like, it's gray on, on purple, and that's really a striking image. There you go. Covering that lava. Enabling us to go further on the hunt. But like there's another thing down here. Um, Alright, it's just for food. I can do without that food. It's fine. We got things to slay and thing to discover and a pathway to forge. Uh, Alright, see like that. Okay, so what's going on here? Alright, I need alright, Red! We actually need you, buddy! Why don't you come around? And join us in the festivities. Alright, here I am, he says. Maybe thinking about it. Psychic kind of, oh, You need to like run and then you press it. But you need. Okay, so what I'm gonna need to do is they'll go like even closer. There we go. So I have the space necessary to do that. You did it! You used your head, uh, the genius Red the Baron. Solve the puzzle. And now we have ourselves a nice little bridge. All right, then we can just kind of drop down here. Then there's a secret ledge here with some meat. If you want some wall meat, uh, that can be interesting. All right, okay, so maybe we are getting into the land of meat. All right, I'm gonna make sure you're out of the way. You are out of the way. All right, you keep on doing that, buddy. Big old fireball. Not afraid of you anymore, if I ever was. All right, now we're just gonna hang out down here. There we go. Can I just push him in the lava? That would be good. So someone told me that you can't, like no, you can't attack them even though they're rolling with your sword. Cause that would be pretty rad, being able to like, just kinda like, not be forced to just kinda, cause this guy's just really inconvenient. Like he just slows everything way down. I don't know. I don't know what happened. All right, so here we go. And Stinky comes over, shoots a mighty arrow. You did it. Made that drop. Oh boy, we're gonna do this again. Oh. Oh, what are you hitting? Oh, the switch. Uh, that's annoying. I mean, I can't do that. But yeah, see, like I'm not getting any hits at all. If um. If he's in ball form, sadly. Yeah, that's the whole level. We did! Alright, uh... Alright, you can go in the plays. But sorry, you can't leave without your buddy, Eric the Red. So, he's just gonna simmer on down. You know, he was busy looking at the rocks, comparing them to the rocks back home. Very exciting. You're the guy holding us back, dude! <laughs> wow, you're having a great time. See? Stinky's just having fun killing things, and I compensate her. All right, cavern. That's the place we're at. There's like grass and everything. Grass? Yeah, that's how you pronounce grass now. All right, check that out. That snail, it's dead. That's right. Fun time. It is buried inside wood. All right, so all right, we need we need this guy. This guy's got the ability to have concussions as much as he want. Is that really an ability? It is now. All right, so we're gonna go here and gonna go like, woof, you did it. Solve the universe. Oh wait, so here though, we get like some conflicting uh, little obstacles. I th see what I would like to do. I don't know. Is like get whoosh like here so that both of them are like 
not in the way, right? And then, in theory, I could like just sneak you in. Just make sure everything is timed together well. There we go. Uh, 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 there we go. All right, did it. So now we can just kill Kid Chaos here. There we go. Arrow right in the face. That's how you want to live life, uh, probably. I mean, since you're here, you can just get Mr. Red Key here. You can use it on this real. Wow, I can't believe I solved this puzzle on my own. Uh oh. All right. Um. So, are you vulnerable? Uh. Oh wow. So fire hurts. Wait. Wait. Oh shoot. Wait. Oh shoot. Um. Okay. So my crime there, I guess, was going too far to the side there. Sure. Uh, you know what? It's fine if I take like a damage. Fire removes two hell though. That's good to know. Yeah, this is happening. All right. So this time we're gonna go like all the way here, more or less. I'm gonna send Red over. Is there anything good here? Well, there's a shield. Like it might not be a bad idea to give that to you. All right. I guess I'll do that. So select. You can eat this and also eat that. I guess eat that big old piece of wood. It will be delicious. There you go. Alright, so I'm going to put you guys in position. I just need to leave where the fire is going to go, so everything should be okay here. Yeah, there you go. You got a key. I can do that. And now there's going to be a blue guy here. And this time, not everyone's in danger, so everything's going to be okay. There we go. We solved the puzzle of don't go too ahead of yourself, I guess. Powerful puzzle that everyone struggles with. This is no. It's just like there's fighting these guys is always the same though, right? Like I feel like there's something I'm missing, but I mean this seems to be the cleanest way to deal with them. And it's just like a 10 second tax, I guess. It's kind of a mean thing to say about a guy, but alright. So you're gonna run over here. This feels very linear, where as of now it feels very well. All right, we got this obstacle, we're gonna do that. Now we got this obstacle, we're gonna do that. Maybe things are gonna change. So there's meat in there, but it's not worth it because I have to deal with uh, that other man. If I want to get that meat, everyone is full. I don't plan on taking more danger, so maybe I'll just let him roll around inside his little thing, you know? Have some fun. There we go. Slashed you right in the face. This dinosaur, it's a deadosaur now. Oh, what's this? What is going on here? Um, well, we got lava, and bubble comes out of lava. Everyone knows that. Uh, so we gotta ride that bubble, probably? Like, it's just kind of a weird thing to put. Sweet. This deep in. So was I not supposed to go on that bubble, or or do you need to go like on top of it? Like I thought you, no, no, I just was imprecise, I guess. <laughs> That's it's kind of a it's kind of a butt. <laughs> uh, so I guess the blue guy didn't come this time. <laughs> That's weird. All right, well, I mean, I feel like it saves me a step because then I can just kind of. Slam him that way around the corner. Uh, Balayog is not super fast, but like he's fast enough for these needs. Okay, sure. So last time I had my oh right, I forgot that snail is there. But last time I had my shield out when I fell. That's kind of neat though that its back is protected. So maybe that's why I fell off of the bubble because I because the I I glid basically and that gave me a bit too much force to the size the I said size at the same time that was weird. All right, yeah. See, then you just kind of ride this up and there's like the side passage. I'm probably gonna need to visit because I there's fire here. We're gonna need that yellow, obviously. Can you go back from there? Or is that just like a very awkward little space? I think that's like all Eric. Alright, so I'm gonna hang out here. And then I'm gonna have to go there with this guy. 
And uh, yeah, I'm gonna be behind Olaf, so I should be safe. Yep, flexing got nothing. That's our buddy Stinky. That's what he always does. Anything here? No, okay. This is like, oh, weirdly complicated in terms of construction. And yeah, like, and yeah, then you're gonna up here and you used to do that to go there. Yeah, okay, okay, all right. We're making things slightly, I don't know if there's less straightforward. It's a little bit more risky at the very least. All right, see, but there you go. But yeah, the way you bounce back, it's like, I'm right, gonna just do that, then I'm gonna give it to you, because you're gonna be doing everything down there, so you can have that. Press select. No! I pressed the wrong button. You know what? That's why we have apples. Alright, this can just kinda like uh, oh, okay. So there we go. Yeah, where this door with like metal hinges came from though, I feel like they're shenanigans afoot. But it's okay. Shenanigans. Are the very foundations of video game. Then we gotta ride this we go over here. So there's snails everywhere. There's meat up there, which could be good. There's the exit. All right, but I need to do something there first. I know the blue lock is down here. Yeah, I figured that one out. All right, and use the power of the blue lock. Smash this where you can get a bomb, I guess. Wait, so was the blue lock? Oh, oh, well, you know, I could get the smart bomb, but I can just use good old-fashioned violence because I, I didn't want to get like locked in there like that seems like it'd be pretty much the single worst possible outcome. All right, well, Mr. Fire statue, you're gonna get to keep throwing fire at nothing. You're so lucky. All right, check out me. Um, maybe I'll go ahead and go all the way up and get that meat in case we need it. Cause like, that, that situation down there looks kind of prickly. Well, not really, but see there's that guy and it's like, what a jerk, right? All right, so here we go, we stopped them. We just need uh, a good old frontman here. Yeah, he's so mad, he's gonna slice at nothing. That's what he does. All right, uh, I'm tempted to try and shoot an arrow. Uh, maybe I'll attack like once I'm at the safe place. Even then, like I feel like I shouldn't take the chance. So I won't, I changed my mind. No chance taking at this particular bubble in time. There we go, I did it. All right, so now we go down here. Thanks for holding this guy back. I'm just gonna throw arrows. I'm not throwing them, I shoot them. There's the distinction, there we go. Man died and that makes me smile. Hey, and here's the magical exit tour. We did it. All right, see, things are, I guess my big thing right now is as of now, as the levels are getting a little bit more complex, they're still very straightforward. You see a, a thing, you know who to send now. And that's what I'm expecting things to kind of play with. Yeah, it's a big bubble. Oh, also don't be rude. Like, there he's your battle buddy. Like, come on. Uh, then he's like, Red, please. You are not the one to speak here. Alright, well next time, more bubbles! Oh boy!